But you know what? It may be gray and dreary, but mm -hmm. at least the temperatures aren't dipping too much. Yeah, we actually should be a little bit warmer than yesterday, but it's still going to only probably be in the low 70s, which upper 70s where we should be. Mm -hmm. Tomorrow getting a little bit closer to that, but really not going to see the 80s again until next week. But, you know, they're in sight, so that's exciting. <laughs> so here's a look at our waterfront tower camera. This is a live look out there this morning, and yeah, it does look pretty gray to start. We were telling you over the last couple of days that we do expect some dreary conditions to start your weekend. Could even see some pockets of drizzle. So if you're going to be out and about pretty early, I think Rich yesterday was saying just sleep in or watch us, right? Just relax and watch us. And then later on, it will start to clear up a little bit. But today is going to be a mostly cloudy day. Tomorrow in the afternoon, we probably will see a little bit more peaks of sunshine. But we do have that onshore flow that's bringing in all that moisture, the cloud cover. And that marine layer does have some drizzle mixed in with it as well. So you can see all those clouds as we put the clock into motion. And that's pretty much it. As we're getting into the afternoon, starting into the evening, starting to see a little bit of that clearing, but some clouds are definitely going to stick around. And then tomorrow we'll see a repeat morning clouds, pockets of drizzle mixed in, and then some afternoon clearing. But I think tomorrow afternoon does look slightly better in terms of a little bit more sunshine than today. Temperatures outside right now are ranging in the upper 50s to about 60 degrees, depending on where you are. And it's time for Fido's forecast to get you through the next several hours. And you'll be meeting both or one of these dogs a little later this morning. Shannon and Rocky, part of the Clear the Shelters um, segment that we're going to be putting on for you. And so how adorable they are going to be up for adoption. We'll find out more about them, so stay tuned if you are interested. Um, but notice as we go throughout the afternoon and evening, just looking going from partly sunny to partly cloudy and temperatures, like I said, just really expected to be in the lower 70s, probably upper 60s, lower 70s, you know, because we get quite the range here in Western Washington. As we take a look at your mountain forecast for today, we're looking mostly cloudy with temperatures at past level near 60 degrees and a northwest wind around 10 to 15 miles per hour. That freezing level near 14,000 feet. Here's a look at your seven day forecast and we're talking about similar situation for today and tomorrow morning drizzle turning to uh, some some breaks in the afternoon. We could also see some morning drizzle as we start your work week. However, we're already starting to see more sunshine in the afternoons and warming. Notice we're into the lower 80s by the time we get into Tuesday, but by mid to late week, we actually see a system moving through that could bring in a pretty good amount of measurable rainfall Wednesday into Thursday, but then it looks like we clear out again by the end of the week. Now, long range models are showing a little bit of a system moving through on the weekend once again. So we'll continue to watch that. Um, you know, it's still too early to say exactly with the timing and everything, but could see another round of rain. Well, let's not talk about it now. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Just want to give you the first alert. All right. And, and I appreciate that. Yeah.